We have managed to implement satellite data connectivity onto the Crowbar Grain Storage Monitoring System uh, so that it can be uh, connected to any grain storage site or farm, uh, regardless of where they are located, even if they're lacking uh, standard connectivity such as uh, Wi-Fi or uh, GSM. We finally revealed the little Crowbar robot to the world after keeping it secret for a very long time while being the first company from Scotland being invited to present on the TechCrunch Startup Battlefield uh, stage. And overall, since starting, we've received 14 uh, business awards. And everybody in the, in the Higgs Centre or in the observatory, everybody is, uh, is very welcoming and supportive. Also very nice, lots of different equipment, uh, which, was, which was useful, such as different, uh, different electric equipment, like different ovens and other things. Uh, plus, also, we had access to the, to, to the 3D printed facility at the Raspberry making adjustments very fast and, uh, and prototyping on the spot. So we're getting closer to our MVP and as we look to complete our uh, kind of large-scale industrial test, we're aiming to uh, deploy uh, our, the first version of the Crover Grain Storage Monitoring System commercially from next summer. We set up Crover with, uh, you know, the first kind of proprietary technology for locomotion in bulk solids, uh, which obviously involves uh, moving through not just grains, but also sand powders and any other assembly of solid granular particles, such as, you know, regolith on uh, the Mars and, and lunar surfaces. Uh, so in the future, we see the Crover uh, potentially being uh, applied, uh, for instance, for sampling and exploration on uh, uh, Mars and other planets. And that's something that we'd, uh, we'd like to work on uh, with uh, ESA and other uh, uh, companies and entities involved in, uh, in space exploration.